Commander. Hey everybody, Christopher Rod here. Welcome back to XCOM. Uh, we have a neutralized field commander option coming up here. Uh, we're trying to save those intercepted supplies. We were unsure if we were going to do this, but here we are. Uh, we also get, a, I think, a five-day delay on facility construction. The assassin is unlikely. Uh, we do have an uh, opportune moment. The next uh, infiltration is uh, the mission timer being increased by one. I think we're just going to we're gonna go for this now. Um, we've got short fuse, ghost, deathless, uh, elixir, uh, wraith, and wrath. Wraith and wrath. Ready to rock and rumble. So, uh, let's let's do it let's hope this goes well uh today is the first day uh recording after <laughs> the game of thrones episode aired so that aired uh yesterday uh and we all know what happened in the game of thrones episode so uh the next couple of logs that i'm going to share are uh i guess epilogues for some people this one's written by hootie who is writing for ace our tech specialist in the event of my untimely demise, I request that my body is burnt to ash. I then wish for my ashes to be put inside the missile I have hidden under my bed in my room on the Avenger. Once my ashes are inside the missile, I want said missile to be launched directly at the you Advent Speaker's home at exactly 2 a.m. Probably won't kill him, but it'll be a plans. damn good wake-up call. One of their field commanders has decided <laughs> to tour the actual field. And we're going to make sure he never leaves there alive. Now, a couple things at play here. Find our target um, and eliminate him as quickly as we have, possible. We have tweaked. We have tweaked uh, the mission timer the for this specific type of mission, locating these field commanders. So, Sweep the area when we reveal, I think we should have seven turns. That stand in your way. We should have seven turns instead of the normal four. Um which has proved to be pretty chaotic uh, otherwise. And uh, yeah, we'll see. It's also a different map type because we've usually been in those sewers, which prevent prevents us from really exploring a lot. Um, whereas here, oh, hello. Got eyes on a hostile squad. Okay, that's not bad. Whereas here we can kind of dance a little bit more, I think, and uh, wait for a more opportune time for actually finding um, Got it covered. the field commander. So we'll see what we can do. We do have high ground here. Let's work towards that. Uh, we'll take some half cover there. A uh, short fuse I'm going to pull back slightly because we do want to try and just find the field commander if possible. Uh, Stephanie, what do we want to do with you? Let's just tuck you in here for now. And uh, Wraith will grab this spot. Then we can go up top with Ghost. The The challenge here is always like trying to get right to that edge and see past this on high ground is difficult because you could easily get revealed on that last edge. Okay. Moving. Let's go up top. Got some hostiles Hello. Oh, there he is. Oh, no, wait. Uh... That's... No, that is not him. That is not him. That is a lie. Heading out. Okay. Let's get... Uh... Time to motor. Takahashi up top. Short Copy piece that. here. Uh, Deathless. I just want to peek over here. Inside looks clear. Heading to that location. Stephanie can keep an eye on these guys up top. Now, I suppose they could come down here. And that could spoil some you fun. Watch. Let's see. These guys, they can smell it. They're sniffing it out. They're sniffing it out. Now, if I move to the edge, that's bad news bears. I hear some tippy tapping over... There we go. Uh, nope. That's not even... We've got the objective in sight. Oh, it is this guy. Okay, it is this guy. That's good to know. Okay, okay, that, I thought so, but it didn't... It's weird that it didn't say that last time there. Now, the challenge is getting up here is uh, nigh impossible. 
Um, so one thing we could consider, which would really screw things up if these guys came up top, is we just line up our squad here. We don't have any type of advantage. <laughs> Moving. So that's a bit of a bummer. Moving to designated coordinates. Heading to that location. But... Got it. Moving. It gives us something to work on, and if those guys move, then we'll try and, and deal with that. I, I feel like this group over here is going to cause problems. If they start walking back, great. Oh, jeez, he's leaving? Actually, if these guys follow him, that could be okay for us. Actually, this is okay. This is too... Well, no, I'm not sure. I think the assault trooper is following, and now the rocket trooper is not. Um. Oh man, we have a we have. This is actually a really good opportunity. This is a this is a good opportunity. I think I might wait for them to come a little closer, only because the rocket trooper up here is going to cause some additional problems for us. And I'm worried that if he takes an action and blasts us, that could be problematic. And this guy was patrolling this way. I'm gonna give it one more. I'm gonna give it one more. I now watch these guys. Oh god. Should be fine. I was gonna say watch those guys come up. Okay, Rocket Trooper is now following them. This is, I think, our best opportunity. This is this is definitely our best opportunity. Um, it's not perfect. We're gonna lead the target on the general. And I think what we're going to do is hit like like so. I think that makes sense. I think that makes sense. We, we are going to have problems with this priest and the purifier for sure. God, imagine we can get those plasmas going. We've been spotted! Oh, look at this. We have an explosive barrel. Who's the unlucky soul that's sitting next to it? Beautiful crit, too. Oh, that's really nice. Okay, so a couple of, of interesting priorities here. We have to kill the purifier and we have to kill the rocket trooper. Oh, he is right on that, too. Isn't that just awesome? Um, yeah, this is actually going to be interesting. Uh, oh, man. 47 there. 80% 80, 80 on this. What's our... Do we have any point blank? Yeah, this is actually kind of nice, too. Um, I have to kill this... I have to kill him. The bio assault, I would, I would like to kill. Because he's just going to run up here. The priest probably... Um, stasis is somebody, I think. Oh, wait, maybe you don't have that. Oh, oh yeah, stasis. They can mind control too, and then Holy Warriors also horrible. But if he Holy Warriors, that's actually, in my opinion, that's a that's a that's a buff to us. Um. Yeah, the the big challenge here is is obviously the explosives from the rocket trooper and uh, the purifier. In my opinion. In my opinion. So. That being said, who had the blast padding? Is it the rocket trooper? Nope. Advent bio rocket launcher. He's got the orbital gas strike. Okay. That is, I think, a turn delayed. <laughs> Destructible item. I've never seen that. That's hilarious. Uh, okay. I don't know who has blast padding. Oh, right here. The bio assault. Okay. Which makes sense. 
Now, oh, this is dirty. I'm doing it. I can drop that right below. Oh, man, I hope that doesn't blow up this deal. So now, I can't hit the Bio Rocket Trooper and the Purifier. So... I think we'll go and focus on, on these two. This might even blow up the other thing. Actually, no, hold on. We're going to focus on these two so I can remove this guy's cover as well. Grenade! We should shred this last piece of armor. Yeah, okay. Okay. Um, I need four damage. I could put six to eight here, and which would guarantee he dies on his next turn. Assuming he moves. Right? So let's say we put this damage there. Then I've got Stephanie, who could blow up this thing for six damage, which is huge. Would remove cover, I think. Then I need four damage over there, which I could get with uh, Kaylee. Yeah, I could do that. We could parry. But then she's just standing there, and she's not totally dealt with. You know, I think just in the... In the... Idea of maybe not having everyone up here. I'm a, I'm a little concerned about this thing exploding and taking us down. It wasn't... It was showing all of just these tiles, but... Frick, you never know. You never know. I could come over here, but then Bio Assault comes and flanks us. At least this way, if I'm up here, I don't think he can get up here. And he'll be forced to shoot, which isn't ideal either, but let's take this. I'm okay with this. Okay, so he should die unless he doesn't move from there, which is possible. We do have Sentinel there. Um, you need to kill... Bio rockets. Nice shot. Nice shot. How many is that now? And then we have we do have a we do have a suppression too, actually. We could zone suppress this group because these guys won't die. Oh, you know what we could even do? We could come and get uh if if this I just realized if this guy blows up. Uh, maybe he does take out the floor. I did not think about that. I did not think about that. A stun here could actually benefit us big. But then... I'm not blowing this up. And I definitely want to. I mean, I guess... I guess Wraith could just take that shot. But it would be nice to build some of the, um... It'd be nice to build some energy here. But if she goes in on this, it's too risky. He could blow. Man, I'm, I wish I thought about him blowing up. Ooh, that could be really bad for us. One thing we could do with Stephanie is we could try stunning him and dealing with him next turn. I think I'm going to take this. That's pretty nice. He only needs nine. Oh, we didn't actually remove... We didn't actually remove that cover. From that explosion. Stun on this guy would be beautiful, too. I'm just concerned about him exploding. Hope this works. Let's see if we can put this guy down. Okay. Three actions. That's pretty solid. This guy, I am assuming he's going to blow up. Right? So maybe I just need a regular suppression. 
on the Bio General. Oh, these explosions. I might be overthinking this. The aliens are going to try and extract the general from the AO. Oh, it looks like... Don't okay. Get on board that ship. Looks like our mod idea is not working. That's a good... That's a good stasis. Oh, interesting. Oh, interesting. Oh, God! Okay, the, the floor is still intact, technically. The floor is still intact, but I think we should move, because you never know. Okay. So, a couple, <laughs> couple things. I'm going to have to go back to the modding team and say, uh, this is not working the way we are expecting it. So there's that. <laughs> good test. Good test. I need nine. Hmm. What do we have here? Quick hands, but we also have snapshot, so... Bio Assault Trooper, the fact that he's stunned, I think this is our time to actually go for him. Six to seven. Man. Do I take the risk that this floor is not going to fall? I think so. At least with one. We'll see what we do here. Oh my god. Close. Kidding me. Are you kidding me? Okay, so our marine is locked down. Gotta love it. Bang. I'm gonna do this because I need to get rid of the cover. To improve our chances. And then that puts me within range for Kaylee. I only need six. Feel the power of the Templars. So because of this map type and finding him, we're able to take him down anyways without any of the buffs. I'm curious about why that's not working, but that's okay. Dennis we'll figure that out. Kill confirmed. That's how it's done. We need to clear the we'll area of out. any remaining hostile. We can't allow them to recover the general's body. Now I have a parry. Now I could empower this as well, which actually might be good if this bio assault runs at Wraith, which I would expect. Man, I guess I got to stay here because I need to take this shot. Well, that's a big chunk of damage right there because he's got that deflect or, or reflect uh, thing. Shield deflect, but if he's stunned like this, that ain't happening. Uh, I also have the move here, so let's go in 84, 75. This also gets us off the roof. I realize we're on fire. Nice little bio nanoscale dropped as well. That's big. Those are uh, very nice. Advanced wildcats. Um... You know what? I'm going to bring Stephanie already. down here. I'll set up an empower and a, and a parry there. So we can reflect the damage back. And then let's heal up Deathless. Get yeah, rid of the fire all in one there. go. We did see another group of, I think, sectoids near the start there. So you got to keep in mind we've been pretty noisy. Look at them run. Yeah, he's probably running right to that group. I had to guess. Okay, I do want to get away from this roof section. Around. I've had experiences where these things just fall. Seems doable. Let's get some reloads oh, yeah. here. There's no timer. Tired of waiting around. And we know he's sitting right there. Don't know that I want to deal with it. It's far, but I can reach it. At the moment. 
Let's get a reload here. I'm ready. Let's do an overwatch. Moving to overwatch. I should have opened that door. Maybe now. not. <laughs> what did I say? Could have been one of us. It could have been one of us. Okay, Deathless is clear. I could definitely afford to dangle Wraith a little bit more with all this armor. Hmm. Here I come. Nothing. Let's set up a brace here. Nothing. I hope it's worth it. No problem, boss. Okay. Overwatching. Uh, elixir. Let's put here you here. I don't know if you're gonna have any visual over that edge. Maintaining this area. Come get some. I hear. Okay. Doors kicking over on this side. I don't have any type of like reconceal. Hey. Let's move Wraith up. Looks fine. Location confirmed. Getting it done. I can handle that. Got entrenched there. I wouldn't mind taking advantage of. That scared the hell out of me. Let's do this. Yeah, I wonder where that group went. I'll keep it under watch. Now. On Overwatch. Where are you? If they think that I'm running to them, finally, they've got another thing coming. I might. <laughs> I'll run to them after this turn if we don't see anything. I should have reloaded there. Come on. They're not coming. They're scared. Let's get one reload in here. I think I need a reload on Deathless as well. All right. That will move. Oh, here we go. Oh my god, it's the big one! You might be able to kill it. We killed it. Oh my god. Oh my god, the queen is down. Did not see that coming. Oh, the queen has spawned a million little mutons. I would be curious to hear her. Although I would question whether reason was ever. These guys have a lot of grenades. Oh my god. I must concentrate. I just hope they don't act here, but they might. Good shot. Oh, no. Oh, he's suppressing? Ooh, okay. Who's getting suppressed? Ghost. Yeah, alien grenades. Um, I don't think so, Tim. The shot's actually not bad. And we could do some shredding if this hits. That's nice. And then we could drop down a kill zone on both of these, but we probably kill this Muton anyway. Uh, do I want to run at it, though? That's the question. It's got the counterattack, so... I'm going to say probably not wise. Do I have lightning reflexes on Luchas? I do. I definitely, definitely do. I'm going to run a gun to get in here. I just realized uh, we might also run into the sectoid group now. I really hope not. Yep. Frick. <laughs> Come on. And a codex and a purifier. Damn it. Okay, this changes things. That's a really nice shot I'd like to take. Uh, 
Uh, I'm going to go into full cover here with short fuse. I realize we're giving up some of the height advantage there. And if we could get this. We did not get that, I can tell. Yeah. The twitch. I got nothing. No, I see that. Yes, that's correct. You got nothing. If Deathless gets mind controlled, I'm going to lose it. But this is a guaranteed kill. That's a guaranteed kill. Um, I kind of have to. Jeez, we're just so many missed shots. Again, we're like, I'm stuck on this high ground. But now I think I send in uh, Kaylee over here. And with our sniper shot, I think we kill this abductor. We people. might trigger that codex that we saw there. I'll decide what to do with her turn in a second. We probably move her. But at least we clear the abductor. And then, oh God, I hate, I hate it. I gotta move some people off of this building. Tired of waiting around. Give them other targets. I'm gonna definitely suppress here. This guy I'm a bit worried about. I'm gonna overwatch here. Got it covered. These guys. Yeah, I mean, they're, they might take some shots. They might go for some mind control. I think if I stick here, I should be okay. We got to keep in mind we've got that uh, purifier and the codex back there. And then there's a... Yeah, there he is. I was just going to say. Then we have a priest somewhere as well. Oh, okay. Didn't see that coming. Resist. Good, good. Just hunker. Oh, God. Oh, no. Right here, the wall. No. Oh. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. Okay, that's actually a pretty interesting position. It's a good choice, actually. I think I need some help. Holy, through full cover. High ground, though. It's the right call. This chance to hit is going to be non existent here. This guy is my biggest worry now. Is he getting close enough for a grenade? Maybe on this guy, on Wraith. No suppressing. And now the codex is live. Oh my god. Psionic bomb. Yeah, that makes sense. Weapon disabled. That sucks. Yeah, that's a that's a, an issue, definitely. Um man, I wish I had ways of like removing disorient stuff from here. I think I need to go up on this sectoid. He's dangerous. <laughs> Defeated. Come back to you. Ok, 
Okay. Um... I've got this for a ghost, but it's flankable. I might hollow target something here. We'll see. That weapon disable is pretty, pretty nice, I will say. I'm going. That did force our hand here. Does nothing. We're green to go. Short fuse can come back. Or I move her into half. Which I don't love. She can probably take Stephanie's position. Because this is super flankable as well. And Wraith is sitting here, but she has a bunch of armor, thankfully. I wonder if I don't move back to here. We can use our free uh, heal. This way, I still have an overwatch. This is actually, I mean, this is not a bad shot. Whereas an overwatch on these things aren't going to do anything. And we don't have two shots anyway. I'm going to take this. Ooh, landed. I'm going to put the pressure on this codex so the codex wouldn't feel that comfortable coming down here, I don't think. Whatever you say. And then we're going to do a little uh, hunkering. Standing fast. And then Deathless. I'm thinking here. None of them can see him. Um, I think we're going to stick there. I could set up a brace. But all of our other stuff is about being on high ground with a brace. I, I think I'm just going to... Do I just hunker here as well? Maybe I hunker here as well. Holding position. Now, if this guy holy warriors... Oh, he's mind controlling. Okay. Oh, that ain't good. Oh, that's bad. Can't think. Okay. That sectoid's exposed. Taking heavy fire. Armor, baby. Oh god, that with the crit. Oh my god. Even hunkered. Oh no. The Codex might kill her. Okay, Codex is very far away. Purifier, dumb as rocks. Okay. Holy crap. Okay, <laughs> like, once again, we are in trouble. I could come back for a heal. Short, okay, so short fuse, good news is uh, short fuse doesn't have any grenades left. Has the shotgun, but it's empty. Doesn't have defensive mine. Has charge. 
Uh, so we do want to, we definitely want to move Ghost away from this, away from this codex. There's a sectoid here that we could kill. Um, I would like to put pressure on this priest, but I don't see how this priest is killable. Unless Ghost uses Brace. But um, then I don't think we can. Sh well, I could, I could lead the target potentially, which might not matter if they do something with Fuse. You know what I'm saying? Oh, this is a. This is a. Critical, critical decision. I feel like... Okay, so this one's on Overwatch here, right? So it looks like this is safe. And if I came here, then I could attack the... Um, I could attack the... Priest. But... She's not healed. She's not healed. And we only have one energy, so I'd, I would have a parry. That would be it. Mind you, I could attack from this corner and have that full, that full cover. And then I would also need to have uh, Deathless come and do the similar attack and have the half cover and I think that might be enough and then we would get short fuse back which is crucial here oh see I actually I can't even do it I can't even take the um I can't do the, the brace shot because I didn't reload because I hunkered down there. That's the price we pay. Now, it's very possible that, that with short fuse, they're like, oh, okay, uh, we're going to move. And then, oh, God, I'm out of ammo. Right? That's not unheard of. And we might be able to deal with the, uh, might be able to deal with him, that, that priest next time, maybe. I do have a, a zone suppression here. I have a good shot into a double zone suppress. Purifier is still a problem. One med kit left. Man, very, very, very interesting. I think I'm going to go for this. If I go around here... The only way I trigger Overwatch is like this, these tiles. But we can go through here. That should give us the visual. Oh God, this is tight. 13 damage there. Deathless should see this. Six to eight. going to be very tight. I could also... Uh, actually, both of them can reposition after the fact. So that's an option. But if I can get the kill with Wraith, that would be better. Then I have two energy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ninety-nine. And then 
Rafe needs seven, which is not guaranteed. I will tear you apart. Wait, what? Oh, did I miscount that? Oh, sustain F. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, good. I was like, oh my god. That's fine, I think. Now, Wraith doesn't see anybody. So maybe a parry is the best option here. And then, like, deathless, I move back to this location. The problem is... Yeah, I think parry is the best option. Because if the priest comes up, I think that's ideal. Okay. 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 So now we have uh, short fuse back. What's the plan with you? How am I going to kill this codex for one? I don't, I don't, I don't know that I am. Let me reload ghost. So an 84 here, zero to crit. Armor piercing there. 64 on the codex that then splits. I think I'm going to take this. This puts him low enough where uh, our zone suppression could maybe kill him. Or even... Well... Hold on. Can I? No, I can't include that guy. That would be awesome. That's one thing I really like about the zone suppression is that that height that gets taken into account. These shots, in my opinion, are too low to justify. But this is really good. Okay. So then we zone suppress these two. Um, hmm. If I reload, I wonder if I'm not better off, like, doing some type of, uh, dash into here. We break the overwatch, right? Um, we remove a flank. Mind you, Ghost is, is definitely still flanked. If the Codex wants to flank Ghost, they have it. I don't think we can die there, but then these guys, if they wanted to use grenades, could definitely pull something off. I don't want these guys sitting here together because that's going to entice a grenade throw as well. And then Stephanie could trigger... We could have two overwatches. Ready I think that's our best chance. I'm just... I'm really unsure of whether or not the right call is to move her, like, just as far away from anything as possible. Even here, right? You still have the priest and the sectoid. Or I set up one guaranteed miss. And currently, only the priest sees her. Ugh, this is a hard decision, man. I, I, hate to, I hate to do it, but I think I gotta put short fuse back here. We could reload and take this shot, which I don't think we have AP here, do we? I got tracers. Our chances actually wouldn't be that bad. I would need to deal seven, which we would have six to eight on the on the gun. Um, but if I come here and I give I give the flank to the codex for fuse, 
I think it's a higher likelihood. Oh, but again, we might, we're going to trigger this Overwatch too. So if that lands, then Short Fuse could just be dead. We're green to go. Okay. Well, that might that might just answer our question. I might have to just take this. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Uh, it really depends on this codex here. I think I'm better off overwatching. That purifier will definitely move somewhere. We're going to parry here. I don't think I need to zone suppress because I can't hit these two. Or can I? Look at that. I actually can. Line them up. Beautiful. When we were trying to incorporate him, we couldn't pull it off. Let's see. God, if we had Bladestorm here, we'd be laughing. <laughs> oh man, I wish she, I wish, I wish the priest would have spaced his wraith right there. I wish. Oh, good kill. What a clutch shot. Wait, what? Sexoid was killed. Yeah, okay. Sexoid's dead. Just the enemy. Two big whiffs. This could be bad. Okay. Here comes the flank. Going on short fuse, actually. Wow. <laughs> this, is, this is all of a sudden, this is a freaking action movie. Like, what the frick? Okay, now, now, this is important. <laughs> Again, there's there's one Overwatch which can be dealt with via grenades. We can kill this priest now. I don't know if that's going to remove sustain. I don't think it's going to. Uh, this shouldn't trigger Overwatch. It's only going to trigger if I go that way because of the, the Muton. You will pay the price. That may have screwed our cover there, but that's okay. Did heal an HP as well. Okay. So... The, ch the challenge here is, can I kill this Muton with Wrath, Elixir, and that's it. <laughs> and a grenade from Ghost. Because I need to. If I don't kill this uh, Muton, we're in big trouble. Um... Now, this is not technically a melee action, but does this guy... Yeah, see, I really hope that we could possibly use this to charge into this position. And it's guaranteed. Attacking them with your primary weapon from point blank range. That is not a melee attack. That is not a melee attack. But he's overwatched. So first thing we would have to do is throw that grenade. Um, we could throw the grenade here, but it's kind of a waste on Wrath, in my opinion. Um, the advantage of using it on Wrath means that I can move. Uh, I can, well, actually... Yeah, we're pretty close. So I, I actually think if we use it here and we just expect the snipe from there, 
even if it crits, right, she would still live. Fire in the hole. Oh, but I also just realized if I do come and run up. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't do this to me. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, are you kidding me? Can't see it now? That is the most annoying thing ever. That's so, so frustrating. What do you have as attachments here? Okay, so nothing that's going to impact me if I move for a better shot. You also have 10 health. Let's take the high ground. Here I come! This isn't bad. You know, it's not bad, but, um, Wraith? All right, We're gonna go. bring Wraith up, or Wrath up first. Because if this shot lands, we shred that last piece of armor. Wow. If that would have been an actual kill there, Running dry. that would have been super nice. So I'm pretty comfortable just putting Wraith up here, getting us a little bit closer. I could probably even get away with putting her here. But the teleport, actually, the teleport, you never know. So um, I can move Chen now. The question is, where? Because again, the teleport could happen anywhere. I would presume they're not just going to teleport in, like, behind us, inside the building. And this is out of vision, and they have vision of ghost. Affirmative. Let's go. And just because I'm ultra paranoid. Oh, that's fine. That's only hitting one. Okay. This might be the opportunity where we go here. It's a guaranteed hit. They're going to split into much smaller parts. The challenge is going to be, can I then get a visual of the other units. If they split back here, that's pretty bad. It really depends on how safe we want to try and play this. Finally. I think if I could get these guys into a better range, I'd feel way more comfortable. Wraith, maybe not. You can maybe sit here. Oh, I should have grabbed that loot with you. Damn it. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I could have blue moved that anyway. Yeah, no, I probably could have. Something like this. This is a safe position. Bunker. Stay put. Uh Overwatch. And short fuse, I'm gonna run you here. We'll do.
Okay, we expected these flanks. That's okay. That, that is not great. But it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Six to eight with 30%. Our crit chance is going to be higher when we're next to her. 6 to 8 with 60%. Do I see yellow? Come on, you're teasing. Oh, we did crit. Okay. Okay. Killable. A focus strike of power. I'm okay standing in the open too because I might end up uh, staring. Still have no reload here. Now I have to watch for wrath. Oh, but actually, you know what? I think I think we've got this. It is clear. I think we have this with the grenade. With the grenade. Boom! See ya! <laughs> wow. That went from being like, okay, this is gonna be super smooth, no problem, to whoa. MVP on Wraith. Nice. With the Wang Tang, even. I'm impressed, Wraith. Ghost, nice job. 31 damage, 4 for 5. Wrath, 36, 5 for 8. Short Fuse, 41. 3 for 4. Deathless, 42. Elixir, 25, 5 for 7. Okay. Some of that was... Some of that was dicey. Man, a couple of times where I felt like if we didn't get those correct shots off, explosives were going to ruin our day criminals inflicted a sudden and unprovoked assault upon us today. May our thoughts be with the advent citizens we lost. May they truly be at peace forever in the Elder's loving embrace. Successful shot 80% actually. I didn't, I didn't feel that high in the moment. When you miss a big one, you're like, oh, they're all missing. We're all missing. Wound time's not bad. Ah, oh, shaken, man. Come on. Oh, shaken. These guys are all going to be gone. Mind you, maybe this just shows us correctly. Wraith. Okay. Fuse, which we've seen being pretty nice with the Siams. Uh, this is a two-turn cooldown, though. Harden. Reinforce physical resistances with an energy shield. Grants shield points to the Templar. And when empowered to nearby allies two-turn cooldown. Up to four shield points. Or if you empower, grant all allies plus two. So I imagine you get this. I, get, I imagine you still get the fourth, but then you also get to help your friends. Doesn't end the turn. Can be activated with movement only or momentum action points. Arden's energy shield will always break squad concealment. That's a pretty nice option. Ooh. Meditate is interesting. Meditate requires two actions, always turn ending. That's... That's an interesting one. So this would work better when you're not concealed. I imagine this breaks concealment. This is basically just level up your energy to the max. Which, as you can see, would be pretty nice. Lightning hands. I'm going to take this. I don't know if it's going to pay off. We can always double back and get something like Harden. Fuse is fine. And uh, what do we want to do here? Smoke, low profile, or anti-venom. The... Um, the disoriented days, panic, or stun stuff is nice. A 
may also periodically target an ally in range with a special adrenaline injection. I just don't know if this, like, has to be on their turn. Like, in that last situation where, uh, where, uh, Wraith was disoriented, did we just run up there? And it, it might work? Like, I don't know. Low profile's also really nice here. Okay, I'm gonna grab this, but this is a comeback for sure. Come back and get that. Having recovered another of Dr. Valen's modified alien test subjects, oh yeah, the Berserker we Queen. We begin an autopsy as soon as possible by following we got the nano scale. This was big. Hope that we will uncover the true purpose of her work. This was big. That was a, that turned out to be a very big mission. Uh, plus, we got our intercepted supplies. I think. Lone engineers. I mean, I actually feel like that's. Uh, not true. Fear of heights. Okay, now hold on. Did we get our stuff back? I'm confused. I can't remember how much money we have. <laughs> I can't remember, man. What are we researching? Alien encryption. Okay. Oops. Luchan and Luchas? Yep. That'll do. Love that. Anashi and Stephanie. Yeah, she's gone out there so many times. The ultimate fire team. And now she's got a buddy. Our 100th photo as well. Okay. So, yes, there's some shake in this, but not outside the realm of the crazy times we've seen. 12 here is our current longest. Tyrant's almost back. I, I need to go check to see if this, in fact, got us everything that we wanted. I'm going to double check, actually, in the commander's quarters. Nope, not this. Objectives, no. Avenger report, no. Oh, activity change. Okay, well, I mean, I have to assume that we got some back, and I would, I'll just check and, and see where we were at. I can't remember if we had spent everything or, or not, but regardless, uh, things are things are happening, which is nice. Remove negative traits on Patsy. What is your negative trait? Oh, Vipers. Yeah. I don't know. I think we've seen enough of them start to turn where I'm going to let it, ha I'm just going to let it roll. I'm gonna let it roll. Um, there's gathering survivors now, lost, and it's two people, right? It's two Marines, I think. Yeah, Lieutenant Marine, Lieutenant Marine. I do like that. That puts our crew up to uh, maximum. And then there's another one here consulting the faction. Uh, but then we talked about maybe buying the, the upgrade. For crew size two. Hold on, we're just a few supplies short. So, um, it can work. It can work. There's definitely going to be retaliation soon. That's one thing that I'm uh, pretty concerned about. I'm pretty concerned about that. It's just, I'm, we're banking on how soon that might be. But I'm going to do this. Setting course for the Western U.S. Precinct. This will max our crew, and then I can hopefully hit the black Command, market before the next be one is recruited. We're detecting lost activity in this area. Our forces will need to be especially vigilant. Yeah, this is not the horde. This is not the horde. Uh, I should wait for Tyrant, I think. What about Raylo? Is Raylo available? I would take Raylo out. Absolutely. Raylo's ready to rumble. Oh, uh, you know what I just realized? We don't have the the will card in, right? Yeah, we removed the will card. So, uh, it's a tough call. Um, experimental grenades, heavy weapons. This is just for this month. 
So when this is done, this plasma grenade, then uh, we're going to build some, some of those. Where are we? Supply drop in 16. Yeah, okay. Plasma 29. This expires in 18, unfortunately. Hey, D is back. That's cool. <laughs> it opens up an option, I guess. Uh, the commander with Ozzy, who is wounded. It's possible. What area are, are we in here? Hunter territory. Yeah, I mean, he could definitely show. He could definitely show. You're bonded with words. Field medic here. One sapper, marksman, marine. Here's our extra marines down here. What's your will at? 45? You do have pin him down, but you don't have him placed. I think I'm okay with that. We'll give uh, Izzy a break here. Hound. I was thinking about bringing him. The, the really scary thing right now is what if a retaliation mission pops here? And we're going to be in trouble. I mean, we'd, we'd have two lieutenants, marines at least. Right? We would have that. Some material here with basic wildcats. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna put those advanced wildcats in here. Non-critical hits can graze, raise by 8%. Yeah. I'll take that risk. And we'll keep the bipod. Plated. We're starting to get back to that pre-squad wipe situation where we had gear for everyone. But it's a slow, slow, slow climb. Okay, who can carry Psyamps here? Maybe our marksmen? Field medics, I think, make a great, a great option for it. Null Lance and the Gem Ward. For, uh, Null Lance in the, uh, what's it called? Null Ward. Yeah, double nulls. Mag Rifle with all the fixins. Let's go Shotgun here. Basic Laser Sight and Wildcats. The same on both, I believe. Oh, this has advanced. Okay, we're going to stick with advanced. Advanced grenade launcher. It's 50 supplies. The, the challenge here is... Um, I need supplies to get our next upgrade. I'll have to maybe sell a bunch of Lost or something, which we can do. We can turn them into Meld and stuff later, but we're not even there yet anyways. And I'm going to get more Lost Corpses here. Um, so I think I'll take... I'll buy one of these. Yeah. That feels good. I'm going to put the Ultrasonic Lure on. And maybe the, the vest here so you can kind of tank. I think the commander I'd like to give a vest to as well. Uh, sniper, I'm going to give you Sabat rounds. We're definitely going to have some armor issues, right, in the, in the normal enemies. 
I think we'll put APs here on our Marine. We're gonna go Magnetic Cannon. Our Reaper is so squishy. Let's give you the Vest. And you have the Secondary Amp. Okay, now the problem with this is the Insanity checks are not gonna happen because our size strength is so low. So I'm actually not even gonna take this and we'll take a uh, mag pistol instead. And instead of the hollow targeter, I'm gonna take a shadow keeper. Uh, for the sword, we're taking the arc blade. Uh, do I need more, more armor piercing? Probably, she's got sentinel, decent aim. We do have null lance to deal a lot of damage. To avoid armor. Ooh. Let's give you wildcats there. So just increasing crits pretty dramatically. Scope here for the commander. I think everyone else is good. Like, this seems all right to me. We're gone with pin him down. Some armor. Uh, penetration, penetration here. Some tankiness, some some double armor for all these guys. Sabat rounds here. Uh, two grenades and a lost lure. This slot can be maybe a vest or even a skull jack if something gets crazy. Yeah. Now this, okay, so we recently picked up um, Relentless, right? So the way that this can work is we get a movement only action after we get a kill. And then here we get a non-movement action after getting, after killing an enemy with a turn ending melee attack. So if we dash in to kill something, we're gonna be able to go and attack again, which is cool because we can uh, obviously kill something, and then we have untouchable, and then we get to go and attack something again and retain that untouchable. You can't, I don't think, get multiple untouchables, but even if you put him into a situation that's a little bit more dangerous, you can see where that could come into play, um, which is nice. Okay, I think this is good. Uh, do I want to put anything on the mag pistol? I mean, yeah, why not? I'll put a basic foregrip on it. And then this slot just remains empty. Um, do I want maybe want to give somebody a dedicated ammo slot here? Or is that on, maybe do I do I have that on somebody else? As it stands, I must. I must. Unless I lost it at our recent death, but maybe it's just, maybe it's out there somewhere. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, I think we're good. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Love you. I really appreciate you. Bye for now.